Bethany Lutheran College was founded in 1927 by our synod who owns the building. The new facility that we just opened up this past May 1st is the Bethany Activity Center that as you can see in the background uh, has track and field aspects for our soccer and baseball team to use the turf that's in the middle of the field and enhance the quality of both programs which also has brought increased enrollment to the institution. This is the focal point of their campus and so it was very important that this field house was able to mesh with their entry building uh, to the, the project. One of the main goals was a wow factor. What I've heard from the president, people who have been here at the dedication, students and coaches that have all walked in and said, Mundell, you've exceeded your expectations. You did exactly what we knew you would be doing is making it a first class space keeping it reasonable within the budget area and making sure it's an experience for the students that will last a lifetime. When it comes to being able to engineer the building to, to handle what you can see again behind us, whether it's batting cages, whether it's netting that is going to protect the, the track from the turf area, lights, uh, divider curtains, basketball hoops, which are not in this building, but those are all things that you would not be able to hang in a bubble and you also have a tougher time in our competition that are using truss systems when it comes to fabric buildings. Hence the pre-engineered rigid structure of this building is what allows us to build in whatever loads we need to. And that, that again gives the customer the ability to, to do what you see behind us. The maintenance and operation of the facility is even as far as when you think of overall utility costs and making the facility work. Uh, for us at Bethany here, landing on that uh, again, with um, looking at the bidding process, what the project would have cost us, we've saved millions of dollars uh, on the project and been extremely happy of how the building has all come together and the flexibility uh, of the project that allowed us to use other resources to enhance the student experience here in the building. The low maintenance part of the building, especially in a, a sports and rec building where people, balls, things are gonna run into the wall. So by being able to clad the inside of the building with fabric, not only do you get the better energy efficiency, you get a better lighting because of the reflection, you, you have a softer feel, but you also have a, a, a material that's gonna deflect a little bit. It's gonna be flexible. Our field house isn't air conditioned. But it's cool, the, the, what I'm going to call the insulation and the rating factor in here, you're not sweltering here like you would in a bubble. And a bubble in the winter time obviously gets much colder. We can control that temperature aspect in here as well for our, our student body. We're extremely excited about the building and proud of what's here. Proud of our partnership of all our contractors who've made this um, project successful and affordable for us uh, in this day and age.